I owned a construction company and I was operating during COVID. I'm paying money out on financing costs. Materials can't, aren't there. And, you know, I can't get things done on time. Right. And when the materials are coming, it's the wrong materials is late. It's like all these things. And I think like there's solutions out there that tackle elements of all these things, but none of them were tackling sort of like the procurement journey, you know, for someone as small as me. So I thought that was like a me problem. And then when we looked at the, when I was like, look, I, there's got to be a better solution. There's got to be a better way to do these things. And we looked at like a whole series of things that were interesting to us as a startup that we wanted to go focus on. But we kept coming back to this kind of core thesis, which is the life cycle of from procurement. If you don't, you know, spec it on time, you can't buy it on time. If you don't buy it on time, probably aren't going to get it on time. Very simple, right? And so for large companies and for data center projects where the timeline's more compressed, where the it's more mission critical means it needs to be online, it needs to be online yesterday, you've got to find ways to shorten this life cycle or, pro or provide more predictability or more visibility into this process. And it's more critical there.